Christian Horner has criticized the FIA's inconsistency after Lewis Hamilton avoided a penalty. The seven-time F1 world champion was summoned to the stewards for separate incidents over the Saudi Arabia Grand Prix weekend. The first summons came during the final practice session in Jeddah, when Hamilton is thought to have ignored double-waved yellow flags. However, the stewards decided no further action would be taken, citing, the race director reported to the stewards that the double yellow flag warning on the FIA marshalling system was activated at light panel number 6 accidentally, for less than one second. As the onboard video of car 44 clearly shows, there was no yellow flag displayed, no yellow lights were displayed to that driver and the yellow warning light was not visible on the driver's steering wheel. Unlike other incidents this year, there was no yellow flag or yellow light displayed to the driver, the driver already being well into the marshalling sector when the system was briefly activated, hence no breach of the regulations has occurred. Then, picking up his second reprimand of the weekend, Hamilton very nearly had a collision with Haas driver Nikita Mazepin. He reached turn 8 whilst on a cool-down lap when he was caught unaware by Mazepin, who came speeding past the Mercedes driver. Mazepin was forced to take evasive action as he cut the corner to avoid a nasty crash ahead of the penultimate race of the season on Sunday. The 36-year-old received a reprimand and Mercedes were fined €25,000 for impeding Mazepin during the Haas driver's hot lap. Hamilton did not receive further punishment, which has infuriated Red Bull's team principal. They opted not to appeal against the FIA's decision, but after Max Verstappen was handed a penalty for ignoring yellow flags at the Qatar GP last month, Horner was not impressed. It feels a little inconsistent from what we've seen two weeks ago. We've got the right to an appeal and we will have a look at the information. We haven't looked at it that closely yet, he told Sky Sports. These decisions are so late so we'll have a look. The one thing that we desperately want is consistency. The problem is if we appeal it's the same stewards and it will be the same decision. Things went from bad to worse for Red Bull after Verstappen crashed into a wall during qualifying on a hot lap in the final session of qualifying. The Dutchman, who was caused to clinch pole position, will start in third but could be hit with a brutal penalty depending on how badly his Red Bull car is damaged. Verstappen set two purple sectors in qualifying before locking his tires on the last corner and smashing into the wall. The Red Bull driver eventually came to a halt on the track and stepped out of his car as Horner shook his head in disbelief. The crash could well have damaged the car's gearbox and Verstappen would be forced to surrender five grid places if his team have to replace it. Should Mercedes keep Verstappen off the front row and Hamilton goes on to win the race, he will take the lead in the Drivers' Championship with just one race remaining in the season.